And we are teamed up with the American Heart Association, inviting you and your workplace to Go Red for Women on Friday, February 5th. Speaking of which, Naomi, who do we have with us this morning? We have a very special guest in the studio. Ann Sullivan is here. Um, and we've been talking a lot about businesses around the area going red and women going red. What does it exactly mean for someone to go red on this special day? Well, the American Heart Association uh, has the first Friday of every February as their own signature day to bring about awareness for women and heart disease. And um, it's been going on for over 14 years now. Wow. Um, companies turn their businesses red. It started with landmarks glowing red. Uh, Niagara Falls turns red. The Empire oh, State cool. Building goes red. Uh, the Tower, the Needle in Seattle goes red. The Arch in St. Louis. So that's kind of how it started. And, and you, you'll notice newscasters on national news are all wearing red. Wow. And then we took it to a local level where we started asking local businesses to have a wear red day, um, to have their uh, employees wear red on that day. And then we took it to another level by saying, can you turn your business red? Well, last year, thanks to Town Square Media, um, you guys took over that piece of it. And we had the largest amount of businesses ever, really? larger than most of the big cities. I have talked to people in Boston and New York who wanted to know how we got 32 businesses awesome. to glow red for us. Wow. So our goal this year, with your help again, is to make that 32 into 40 businesses. I think we can do that. Well, I believe. We got five new businesses already that jumped on board. That's awesome. Uh, so it, it makes, it, it's just, it's it's the only day that we really use to create awareness. So when you see Commercial Drive, it starts at first source. The whole Carbon Auto Group goes red. So all of Commercial Drive is lit up. Right. And then with your help last year, we had some of our very special locations downtown go red, the Utica Zoo go red. Um, your building went red, which we you did. can see from Route 49. Yeah. So... We, we've just, we're, we're picking very strategically places, and the people say, why are you red? Well, then we can tell them. Mm. Yeah, and you we can start, start the discussion. The discussion yeah. about women and heart disease. And, you know, we don't take a whole month. We don't, you know, we have a different color every month for, for something right. different. We are Go Red for Women. It's it's February 5th, and that is our Wear Red Day. Um and that's only the beginning of what we do, as you know. Right. Um, but it's a very important day because the awareness of women and heart disease, heart disease is the number one killer of women, more than all forms of cancer combined. So many people still don't realize that. Mm. Right. So this this day of turning red has people asking questions. Right. And it brings awareness to it, you know. It's our signature day. That's what we call it. Yeah. Um, now, February 5th is businesses will be going red um, people working will be wearing red. Um, if a business is deciding to go red, put lights up, all that, do you guys start at a certain time? Do they do it all day? Um, how does that exactly work? Well, we do have a start time. Okay. 4.30 on Friday, February 5th, we ask everyone to flip the switch and glow red. Okay. Uh, now, some businesses have to go through a little bit more to, to glow red. They, they do a lot of work, so they'll keep that some may glow red for the whole month of February, okay. which is heart month. Some may turn them off the next day. Some may glow red for the week. Right. It's all up to the business. And there's so many different ways they can do that. They can change their spotlights. They could put red paper over their windows and leave their lights on that night. They could use red Christmas lights. Oh, that's a good that's idea. A good idea. Yeah. yeah. So it, it's just anything you can do. We've got a business who puts red hearts and red dress cl uh, window clings in their window. Right. And they leave their lights on. So as people go by, you can see the red in the window, even though they can't do their lights. Anyone interested can contact, obviously, um, the American Heart Association office or call right here at Town Square Media. And we've got all the information on how to get them to glow red. 768-9500. That's our number.